Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to Life with V. Um, as you guys wrap up the title today, I'm sorry, I'm a little messy because I'm trying to get ready for everything. Just a quick disclaimer, if you guys hear um, noise in the background, um, I do have my brother playing um, here with us in, in the room. He is watching the game as well, and then Aaron's here and my dog. So I just have a lot of stuff going on, but I'm gonna try to make this video quick, fast, and then explain to you guys. So bear with me, I'm a little nervous. And I run out of breath really, really, really quick. So, yeah, guys. Okay, being all, uh, being nine months pregnant and like, you know, trying to get things done, it, it has been a little bit hard for me, but I am trying my best. So, oh, shoot. I have a lot of lint in my shirt. So, if you guys see like lint, so sorry. But before we get started, if you guys are new to this channel, please go ahead and subscribe. Hit that bell notification so every single time that I upload a video, you guys will be notified and be ready to watch. And if you guys are not new to this channel, welcome back. Thank you so much. My name is V. As you guys all know, thank you for being here. Thank you for supporting me. And if you guys are not following me on my social media, please go ahead and follow me on my social media that we list down below. So without further ado, let's get started with this video. All right, guys. So whew, I'm already running out of breath, and I just did the intro. Not cool. So first of all, I wanna I asked you guys a lot of questions regarding like what do I really need in my bag for the hospital. A lot of you guys said don't take a lot because the hospital will be providing for a bunch of stuff. So I'm just trying to take more of my stuff instead of the baby, but I will definitely show you guys um, what I have for the baby. Hopefully, if I don't run out of breath on this one, but I want to show you guys what I have for me so far. So first of all, I want to start. I already opened them because I already put some in my bag, but this diapers right here, you guys recommended these diapers. Said that these diapers are really good. For um, after having the baby, um, I am going to be bleeding, so definitely it's very important to have some. These come in handy, so I went for the option that you guys gave me, and I am taking three only. I'm not, I'm not sure if that's a little bit. I heard that they give you like some disposable kind of cloth at the hospital, so with that it probably would be four. So I'm just taking three just in case and leaving the rest at home. If I need to buy more, obviously, I'll just send Erin to go buy more. Um, you guys also recommended Dermaplast. Um, somebody told me Dermaplast is very, very good, especially because it's for pain, burn, and itchiness because we are not allowed to basically clean ourselves like down there, like wipe ourselves like we're used to. Uh, we have to get a squirt a bottle and then like, clean ourselves like that. I don't know how I'm going to do it. But I think I'm going to have to. They're probably going to tell me at the hospital. But I got two of these so far. I thought they were, they were going to have like bigger ones. But I got two. I'm taking one for the hospital. And then leaving one here at home. And if I need to get more then like I said. I would just send Aaron to go get me more. So that's what I'm taking. Also you guys recommended um, stool softener. Because it's going to be hard for me to like poop. Um, or you know digest the food in the way it needs to be so i got the Do docolax docolax stool softener hopefully you guys can see it this is the one i got i'm not sure if it's the one that you guys get or not but i got that one um it's pills and it's 25 liquid gel pills and it says gently release painful hard dry stool just in case i need to like let things out definitely have the stool softener and then I got the Medela um, nipple cream. So this is the one I got. I was going to get the other purple one. I might just get the other purple one and see how the difference works. But so far I got this one. I have not put on any. But I know I need to start putting some because it, it's, it's a must. Okay guys. Sorry if I'm going kind of fast because I get like let me let me go and show you guys also I got the freedom mom kit this is what I got and honestly 
I was gonna buy them individually, but if individually is gonna come out way more expensive. The only thing that does not come in here is the bottle to like what to spray down there. So I heard that at the hospital they will be providing one for me. A bunch of you guys said it, so hopefully, hopefully my hospital does provide for it. But other than that, I have this and let's open it and see what comes in here. Cause honestly I heard really good reviews from them and hopefully everything is good in here so let's see what it has it says it has um disposable postpartum underwear already oh so i probably won't need to get any no more right now instant ice maxi pads it only comes with four pairs though on on the underwear and on the maxi pads you guys recommend the underwear instead of the pads the um, cooling pad liners perineal or peri perineal i don't know how to spell it or pronounce i mean and then healing foam and then with a five ounce healing foam and then a 24 um hazel liners wipes i'm pretty sure they look like wipes and then toilet storage so huh let's see and like I said, it's a postpartum recovery essential kit. Okay, let's see. Let me open it real quick. If I can open it. Open it. And then it says it has the box like this. Okay. And then it says uh, free to foam postpartum prepare. And I'm pretty sure this is like... Oh, it's actually a little guide. It shows you guys like how to work things and stuff. So this is like really nice. I might just look over it before, um, you know, I do anything. So here are, I'm pretty sure these are the, these are the instant cold therapy pad. So these are the pads, you guys. They are this long. They're huge. Oh my goodness, they're huge. And I got four of four of those. And then they come with the baby, the boy short free. So these are the underwear. Those are the pads, and these are the underwear um, for them. And then they have the liners, the wipes. I think these are wipes which hazel pet liners so gotta do this 24 on there and then they have the foam right here this is the foam you guys and i think that is it for it i'm not sure i don't think it comes with anything else and it comes it's really handy because it comes with a like a little kit right here so i'm definitely gonna be packing these in my bag honestly i saw another one of a youtuber and it had like a little um rope type of thing like a nursing um rope but i'm not sure i'm not sure if i'm gonna get that i wanted to but now i'm like okay no so i just don't want to buy so much and then at the end of the day i don't really need all that definitely so this is what I'm going to be packing the Frida, sorry I have to take a screenshot, the packing for my um, delivery and of course I know that you guys mentioned to pack um, comfy clothes like PJs so I'm probably going to pack my Christmas PJs, the black and red checker ones, um, slippers, pantuflas, socks obviously and um, a lot of you guys said blankets, but I don't know if I really want to pack blankets. I just want, I'm pretty sure we're only going to be staying there for like a day and a half the most. Maybe two. I don't want to, I don't think two days, but a day and a half. So I really don't want to overpack myself. And la mera hora, like, I'm over here carrying like a bunch of stuff. And it's like way too much for me or for Aaron. And then obviously we have the car seat set up on the on the car already and then for the baby babe can you bring me my um the bag of the baby 
And then for the baby, I'm going to show you guys a little bit. But I'm going to be switching it up because I kind of like got new clothes. So I kind of just want to like get um, different ones. But this is a bag that I got. I know a lot of people tell me like get a big bag and some tell me you don't need a big bag. Uh, we bought a bag from Coach and this is our backpack. Very cute. It actually matches with my purse that Erin got me for Christmas. So... I know that you guys said onesies so I have a couple of onesies I'm not sure which ones I kind of want to like use they are already washed it smells so good the baby detergent just smells so good like I feel like I'm gonna be smelling my son 24 7 like I'm just gonna be like all the time I'm gonna be annoying as mom um I got these little um, jerritas. I don't know how they are called in English. Do you know what these are called? These jerritas? No, huh? What are they called? I don't know, but this is for when he throws up or something, you know. Um, I got a couple of these. I don't even think I need all of these. I, I packed... Oh, actually, I only packed three, so... I got that. And then this, the sacamocos. I don't know... <laughs> to um take off take out his little booger so i got one of these also i got a pacifier and then i got his little uh pacifier like um clip so i got that already too in case he needs a pacifier i don't i don't even know if he's gonna need one right now i'm not even sure and then obviously i got some sw the swaddle things these are so cute you guys look at them like they just look so cute very very cute these are like um i don't know how to explain it but i might just change it because i have more swaddles and then of course i got his outfit for him to come out from the hospital um some two blankets that i got and what else what else can i say that i got for him i think um let me see here i'm actually gonna fix this again because i kind of don't want them oh i got his little socks got him little socks so in case he needs socks obviously and then his little kind of like it's kind of like shoes but it's sock shoes i don't know how to explain it little telita shoes i got his pair this is the one that i kind of want him to wear and then um yeah i think that's really all i really got for him i heard that i don't need diapers because they're gonna be giving me diapers so i'm not taking any diapers or maybe i might take diapers like in the other bag that we're gonna leave in the car and we're gonna take a uh, wipes because we just never know he might just want to be like a cagon and he wants to poop everywhere i'm not sure but I got a couple outfits just in case he does poop and I need to change them. Oh, and then I got the little things. So like when he's here, I got like these little circle ones. I think you guys seen it where it says one month, one week and all that. So I got one where it says I'm here and I think that's very, very cute. So I'm going to be taking photos. Obviously, I'm going to take my camera, my charger. Hopefully, I'm going to try to record. If they do not let us record, um, we're going to hide the camera and then record just the sound or try to record where they don't see us because i've been seeing that a lot of them do not allow you to record your delivery and i understand but you know this is important for me so we are going to be taking that as well and then what else do we are we taking i think that's about it you guys honestly it's just coming closer and i'm getting a little bit more nervous as time goes by I'm um, gonna be 38 weeks this week coming up already and in a couple of days and um, I am nervous because I did start bleeding a little bit a couple of days ago and I was freaking out I was like what the heck's going on but it's called um, bloody show or something like that I'm not really sure um, my suegra was telling me about it and I looked it up as well so it's basically like my cervix or how do you say it it's preparing my body's preparing down there's preparing for me to like give birth you know my body's changing obviously it's it's no it knows it's getting closer to that due date so i'm like oh shoot so i'm super nervous but 
I have faith that God is going to guide me. I just pray that my baby comes out fast, quick, and I know I'm going to feel the pain, but I just want to be able to, like, have it smooth. So, hopefully everything goes well. I, I leave everything in God's hands. And obviously, I'm going to be taking my water. Oh, I'm actually going to take some snacks, which are... Let me show you guys the snacks. Okay, guys. So, I'm taking some snacks, like I said. And I got these snacks. I heard that to take, like, more snacks for, like, breastfeeding. So, you can, like, um, have milk. So, I got these at Target Lactation Cookie Bites. And they're um, oatmeal chocolate chip cookies. That sounds really fire. So I haven't tried them. I actually don't want to try them this week. And also, um, I got this a while back, and it's called the Upstream Milk Flow Electrolytes Breastfeeding Supply. So supplementing me. And I'm gonna be taking this as well. Um, these are some packages you put on your drink, and this should be helping you also um, for you to produce milk for you to um, feed your baby. So the only thing that I am really not, um, that I still don't have, I haven't purchased, but I've been looking at them. And then I asked my brother because my brother, um, my sister-in-law gave birth last year. Was it last year? Yeah, last year to my niece. And she um, did not use a breast pump. So I might just purchase it from her because honestly, I haven't seen one that I really kind of like. I just want to see it though I always wanted the ones that are like you just attach you don't have to be like doing it on your own or having all these like tubes everywhere so I just wanted the one where you latch it onto your thing and then you can be doing chores you can be carrying the baby you can be doing all these things so I don't know if I'm gonna get that I did find one for a good price not that bad um, but I'm not sure how long it's gonna take or if I can find it in the store so I don't have to be waiting for it because at this point I don't want to order anything that's gonna take long oh and we haven't got a stroller which I'm like kind of like upset because me and Erin don't make up our mind of what stroller we want but um, hopefully if the baby doesn't come by the 16 or 17 uh, we got we're gonna be getting all those things that we like finalize the whole thing but we got his little bassinet set up. We have all these things set up. And I'll probably be making a video showing you guys his area. And what I have already set up here at home. For uh, us to welcome the baby. So thank you guys for tuning in. This is all I have for you guys today. Um, if I am missing some stuff, please let me know. I will be very grateful to know things that I do need and I don't need. I don't want to be um, taking things I don't need or that are just going to be adding to my bag just more weight. So thank you so much you guys for tuning in. Like I said, if you guys are new to this channel, hi my name is V. Don't forget to subscribe, hit that bell notification. And if you guys are not, um, thank you so much for tuning in once again and supporting your girl.